Yes, what is happening YouTube? So today, I'm headed into London to go to Duke and Dexter. Now if you don't know who Duke and Dexter are, look them up. They make amazing shoes. And they've just done a collaboration with Snoop Dogg. So they've got a little pop-up store in Soho. So I got invited down to their private party. And I thought I'd bring you lot along with me and maybe I'd do some magic. So let's go. Coming real, it's the next episode. Doing you good? My name's Ryan, what's your name? Phil. Phil and you? Galvin. Galvin, you good? You wanna come in as well? Watch this. So hold, hold on to this deck for me. Now look, place it there. Now inside this deck, I turned over four cards and I placed them face up. Now look, if you was playing a game of cards right now, a game of poker, and I was to ask you, what four of a kind would you like to be dealt? What four of a kind would you want? Now, go. Ace. The aces, Ace. what would you say? The ace of space. So would you have gone with the aces as well? So collectively we went for the aces. Now th this would be interesting if the four cards I turned over in that deck <laughs> were actually the aces. Before I came here, I actually turned four cards over and I placed them inside this deck. But you're probably thinking, oh, most people normally go for aces. And I did actually turn the four aces over in this deck because 80% of people do choose aces. They do. So I want someone else to name a random card. Who wants to do it? Actually not, we're going to create a card between four of you. So we're going to start with you. Do you want numbers or pictures? Uh, numbers. Numbers. You choose a number card between one and ten. Go. Eight. Eight. You, now, there's red cards and black cards. You choose red or black. Red. Red. Now, there's hearts and diamonds in the reds. What do you want? Diamonds. Diamonds. Right? So what value did you say? Eight. The eight of diamonds. I'll let you change it if you want, or do you want to stick with it? It's totally up to you. You want to change to the eight of hearts? Yeah. Is this fair? Yeah. Did I influence yeah. any of your choices? Eight, eight of spades. The eight of spades. Would you like to change your mind? No. Would you like to go against him and change his mind? Yeah. Go on, to what card? Go. Uh, jack of diamonds. The jack of diamonds. Are you happy with that? Yeah, yeah. Yes? Would you, like to, would you like to go against him or not? Seven. The seven of what? Hearts. 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 The seven of hearts. Would you like to change your mind as a group? No. I want five of hearts. The seven of hearts. Are you sure? You don't want to change your mind. Are you happy with this? You pick the aces. You pick the aces as a four of a kind, and then you pick the jack of diamonds. Now I'm going to show you inside this deck. Remember at the start, I said to you I turned over four cards, and the actual four cards were the aces. See, look. So this wreck is interesting, because they are the four aces, yes? They're the only four cards turned over in this deck. Yeah. But look, could you hold on to this deck for me? Now you could have named any card, yes? You named the seven of hearts between four of you, collectively. See? I took these four aces out from a different deck, and I actually marked them, because look, the, hold it, hold it there, the seven of I'm sorry, what? Yes? Thunder, I'll take your card. The? No. Eight. No, 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 no. Eight. Of. No. Heart. What the fuck? What the fuck? No. Oh my god. I don't understand. And you name what card the Jack of Diamonds? Yeah, yeah. yeah. This way it gets really weird because I wrote something down. The, hold it. Jack of Diamonds. That's great. I am baffled. Collectively between four of you. But he got it. Wait, hold them up properly. Pandora, hold your card. Where is that? There is seven of hearts. Six. There we go. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it. That was fucking good. You wouldn't have changed your mind, then we would have been on the eight of diamonds and this would have gone wrong. <laughs> The eight is my favourite number, so I would always have chosen eight. It's 
weird, isn't it? Um, Thank you. No, Cheers. Thank you. <laughs> Tell them my name's Ryan. What's your name? Chloe. Chloe, nice to meet you. What's your name? Diego. Diego, Diego. and you? Gio, Gio. Gio, Good nice to meet, to meet you. you. So, I want to show you something now. You called me over from performing there. I want to show you, you said mind reading stuff. So I want to show you something now. I believe the most personal thing to a human being is our bank pin, our bank details. We don't tell anybody this, right? So is there any possible way I could know your bank details? Is there any way I could know your bank pin? No, we've just met, yes? Now, have you ever heard of muscle memory before? Like, it's like texting. When we text, we don't even look now, we just type it in. So when was the last time you went to a cash machine to draw out money? A couple of days ago. And did you look where the numbers were or did you just, you just type, right? Yeah. Hold out your finger like this. Is that the thing you type with? Just close your eyes. Imagine right now you're at a cash machine. Do not guide me whatever you do. Just in your head. In your head guide me, but do not guide me with your arm. Do you understand? Good. So imagine you're at a cash machine right now and you're typing this number in, the first number. The first, it's in the middle row, isn't it? Yes, six, yes? Good. <laughs> Six nine, yes. <laughs> yes. Yes, Good. I know. Uh, Chloe. Come on here, Mario. Come on here. Get the reaction here. Six nine. Six nine five, yes. Yes. Yeah, no, no. Oh my God. Wait, wait, wait. Stay, stay. Keep quiet a second. Six nine five. Six nine five zero. Your bank pin, yes. Yes. There we go. Good. Yes. Cool, right? Cool. You're not gonna tell me how you do it. I just wanna know. Crazy, isn't it? As we're at the doghouse, Snoop Dogg, right? So what's this? I want you to use your imagination. We've got a pen here. What's this? I'm going to draw something. Watch. Right. My drawing is atrocious. I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, uh, yeah, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, when's the writing in the room? <laughs> <laughs> If you look out of a slip. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> no! <laughs> Try it. I'm so It's an imaginary Snoop Dogg split. <laughs> Let's begin with a little card trick, okay? So I have a deck of cards here. Now look, I'm going to go through this deck, just like this. Mm -hmm. You're going to say stop whenever you want. Stop! No, we're not going to do it face up because I can see the card, right? We're going to do it face down. So say stop whenever you want. Stop! Are you sure? Yeah. Do you want me to carry on? Nah, babe. Have a look at your card and remember it, yes? Good the card. camera can yeah, see it as yeah, well, yes? Good. Now there's no possible way now I could know this playing card, is there? No, because if we would have went any further, we would have been using a completely different card. Does everyone agree? Yeah. Good. So now let's make this even more interesting. Do you have any coins on you? I do, but I don't want one. Yeah, take out any coin you want. It doesn't matter. Any coin. Now, do you think it's... Do you... Tempe. actually something. Now, do you take the Tempe for me and flick it? What does it land on? Heads or tails? Heads. Heads. Would you like to flick it again or not? Are you happy? What do you reckon? Stick, Stick with heads. Yeah, yeah. Now look, I want you to remember this. Did I influence you to choose that card? No. I did I? No. I had no idea. Right, did I influence you to choose that card? No. No. Now, did I influence you to choose that coin? No. Did I influence heads or tails? No. No, so all of this was just Our fate. Our unconscious. Yes? Yeah. Fate, yeah. Weird, isn't it? Because this way it gets interesting. This is the mind reading part. Look at me a second. Just think of your card for me. Just think of it. We all remember it. So look at me a second. So with you, it's a red card, isn't it? Yes? The red card. Now in, in the red cards, there's hearts and diamonds. So look at me. Heart, yes? Good. Look at me. Now there's numbers and pictures. Just in your head, just say it to me. Number or picture. In your head, just say it. Number. It's a number card, yes? Your lip went up on, on, to the left-hand side. It's a number card, yes? Good. This way it gets interesting. 
because you picked the 10p out of all coins so that tells me that your card's reasonably high that's the reason why you picked the 10p and it landed on heads right so this tells me that your card is going to be reasonably high quite high i think your card if don't, i'm correct don't. is the nine of hearts yeah? That's the mind You're reading joking. part. But wait, You're but wait, but wait, this is where this is where it gets even more interesting. Yeah, that was there. What this wait, the, wait, But this is where it gets even more interesting. You could have chosen any coin, yes? yes. Did I tell you to choose the 10p? No. How about I did? I influenced you. Because no, before I walked over to you girls, I took out one card the nine of hearts and I wrote something down on the back of it. You flipped the 10p and it landed on heads. <laughs> what does it say on the back? Turn it over. You are too and he and it was oh my god that's so good Tony 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 that was really good that was really good that was really good oh my god I just have to go back in your the power of influence right really good can I have Tony back she's got it not me oh my god amazing you're joking! That's cool, right? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> that was so cool, right? Cool, oh, amazing! Cool, cool, cool. I don't know how you did that. That's the first magic trick I've seen. I'm like, I don't know how you did that. It's cool, isn't it? Like, you know, you see other ones, you're like, I fucking know how I did that. It's alright. It's alright. It's alright.